Bracken. Maybe. Yeah, for that. I hope you don't mind me filming. <laughs> Under the age of two. She's two. Yeah. <laughs> Can't go through here, but. Hello, hello everybody. Welcome to Movement Films. Welcome to Train Ride on well, the Brecon Mountain Railway. Pants starting here at the ten, at the seven terminus of Pants Station. The train's just coming in, so we'll uh, see you on the train. What happened? Mm. It's, uh, it's cheaper, and it's, um, it's much more comfortable. Oh, it's down the way, anyway. Oh, I'm a break. Thanks. Sorry, mate. So, basically, um, this used to be part of the Mer Brecon and Merthyr Junction Railway in the 1800s. And the Brecon Mountain Railway started in the early 80s. Um, yeah, um, first of all, our owner bought the site. It was a standard gauge railway originally, um, built in 1859 and closed in 1964. So the last passenger trains came through here about 1963, and it connected Newport, connected Newport Docks called Alexandra Docks all the way to Brecon. And British uh, Rail, well, Dr. Beechin closed the site in 1964. The land then was sold on to various farmers and our owner who was involved in narrow gauge railways wanted to buy the land and build his own narrow gauge railway so he started that process in 1978 and had to acquire land for the first uh, three or four miles of 12 different landowners uh, the original station is just up on the hill there so this first so five this to six hundred meters um, originally. is part that he had, had to uh, excavate and lay track. The original track is just around the corner there, it eventually joins on to what was the main line. Uh, at the moment now it's just over five miles long and um, he established it in 1980. It only went as far as the first station which is called Ponsticketh and he started the business with just one little carriage and one little local which was a quarry handler from Leeds called Sybil. Hmm? And where my colleague would have been standing to sell you the tickets at the booking office, he would have been standing in a garden shed in those days in an empty field because all these buildings here weren't even constructed. So these weren't built later then, these weren't they were the original much, much later. structures, yeah. So as I say, it opened up in June 1980 and only went as far as the first station, which is just over a mile and a half from here. And about 1988, they extended it to just short of the next station, which is called Donaghair. Donaghair. And then finally, the extension up to Torpandai, which is the highest point, just over 1,300 feet above sea level, opened up in April 2014. So as late as that? The Baldwin Loco. That's, an, am that's an American train, yeah. American train. American train. It's called the Santa Teresa. It actually worked in Brazil in its early life in a sugar plantation and that was called the Santa Teresa Plantation. Our owner acquired it around about 2002 as for the scrap and they spent the last 16, 17 years uh, building it into its current condition. But over the last uh, year they really had to concentrate on getting it ready for the start of the season because of similar local which is a number two very similar to this, a Baldwin local built in Philadelphia had to have its 10 year boiler certificate that ran out which is going to have it so he does have to have sort of so system. this is the current one that we use oh yeah thanks mate yeah sure
now at Ponsticket Station when we got some old uh, Ponsticket Station when we got some old uh, train carriages that look like they made it to a cafe. Oh, sorry, my darling. Sign for Ponsticket. There's that little train. So pan side. Here we are. So pan side. Top, so we went down to Dowlice. This looks like it used to be an old school. This part of Carter Castle. This part's like a big hall. Didn't even know any part of this was abandoned. Yeah. Arthur Park Miniature Railway. That's new Miniature Railway. This would be in Castle Hold. Yeah, I didn't envision there being didn't envision there being stations on the miniature railway, but we've got Castle Hold. 50. Free for kids, free for Grace. <laughs> <laughs> 